Just two weeks ago, the royal family's website was officially updated to include Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's children's royal titles. The change saw references to the siblings altered from Archie and Lilibet to read Prince Archie Harrison of Sussex and Princess Lilibet Diana of Sussex. While the public rarely gets to see the youngsters, but royal fans were left puzzled at the weekend when Prince Archie's profile page disappeared completely from the royal family's website. The profile of three-year-old Archie displayed a 404 error message. Archie's page had included some details about him, including facts about his birth, baby photos and King Charles and Queen Camilla's tweet upon his arrival. However, for a number of hours, the entire page was unavailable with a message stating, the requested page could not be found. Happily, it has now been restored. It comes after Meghan and Harry used their daughter's title for the first time as they confirmed that Lilibet had been christened in an intimate ceremony at their home in Montecito. Hello! Exclusively revealed that King Charles agreed that the Duke of Sussex children should use their royal titles at the end of 2022 despite the fact that Harry and Meghan have stepped back as working royals. It's believed the couple will use their children's titles in formal settings, but not in everyday conversational use. They are said to be keen to not deny their children their birthright, but to allow them the chance to decide for themselves when older whether to drop or keep using the titles. The rules set out by King George V in 1917 mean Archie and Lily, as the children of a son of a sovereign, are automatically a prince and a princess. It is still not known whether the Sussexes will be present for the coronation of King Charles on the 6th of May. The historic event falls on the same day as Archie's fourth birthday.